I think it is among the most fun and positive things that you can do, whether or not The Motley Fool ever told you to do that or not. Right. Right? The act of becoming a part owner of companies that you admire, mm -hmm. companies whose products you love. A lot of people love Apple. It's been a pretty good stock over the last 10 or 20 years, yeah. right? It's, it's now the largest public company in the world. The first trillion dollar company. That's right, value, and yeah. it's been tremendously successful. And a lot of people, the reason it's so successful is because they love the product. Right. And so for anybody who ever bought an uh, iPhone, I'd say, did you think about also spending that same 200 bucks saving additionally, buying some Apple stock? Because right. that iPhone's gonna depreciate, and you're gonna have to buy the next one, but the, that Apple stock, that appreciates. So. To, to, to go away from the stock market briefly, you know, a lot of people buy that first car right. and they don't realize that's gonna be a depreciating asset. It's maybe not the best way to spend your money. If instead you'd spent that money with a $30,000 stock purchase and you play that forward 10, 15 years, you start to see the power of not buying cars new that often. So, so I think it should be fun. I think it is fun. I love the companies I'm invest, invested in. I'm fascinated by Intuitive Surgical, which is bringing surgical robots and improving outcomes for people, or Netflix, which is the way I've spent a lot of hours. Right, These are companies I love, so I think this should, should be by nature fun. And maybe a lot of people like fantasy football. I like fantasy stock ball. I think <laughs> that we should have the same fun that people have with watching sports with our stocks. You know, and it's interesting, it's so often uh, over the years, my mother had like she like when we were having to have traffic directed to go into a Whole Foods, you know, when it first came out in our town. She's like, you ought to go buy that stock, you know, uh, Home Depot. You ought to buy it because she's just these crowds. And 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 back then, of course, I was smarter. I went and I looked and I said, well, you know, it looks like all the growth is priced in already. Blah blah blah. That's when Whole Foods was at like twenty or something. You know? And so my mom actually was a much better stock picker than I was. I appreciate that. But, but I think that's the point. Is what you're saying is that if you're a consumer of something that you have a passion about, that's probably a good stock to be in. You know, given and some other you know, uh, considerations, but that's one way to look at it. Absolutely, in fact, that's the truest way of looking at it. The reason that the stock market exists is so that people like you and me can take part ownership in the companies themselves. They take in our money and it allows them to grow their business, right. but we become part owners. And so it's, it's amazing that every day you have access to thousands of companies that you and I could right now become a part owner of. And then the only question is, a, do I have the money? Mm -hmm. Am I saving? Mm -hmm. Am I saving 10% of my salary mm -hmm. every two weeks? I hope so. Yep. And then B, okay, which one out of this kid in the candy store, farmer's market here, which booth do we want to go up to? We're not going to be buying fruits and vegetables. We're actually going to be buying Hasbro right. or Disney right. or Under Armour. And why would we buy this one over that one? And which is going to be the best one? And the, if you're a gamer and I'm a gamer, like I'm not even an investor. I'm really just a gamer who happens to invest. If you're a gamer, this is like the greatest game of all, is asking what's going to beat the market? What's going to be the best? What's going to be the next Apple? That's one thing we do every day at The Motley Fool. And over the last 25 years, we've gotten it right some of the times, and it's tremendously fun when you do.